Hello everyone and welcome to the first episode of our new series here on Tusker Times called What's Cooking Good Looking? where I, head chef Tom Garrity, teach you, the audience, how to make easy to do, fun and delicious dishes right at home with help from me, cooking expert Tom Garrity. For today's dish, we are going to be making fresh homemade meatballs, a delicious dish for anybody to enjoy. Now, let's not waste any more time and get right into what kind of ingredients we're going to be using today. Now, for the ingredients for this dish, we are going to be needing one pound of ground beef, one egg, one tablespoon Italian seasoning, a half cup of breadcrumbs, a half teaspoon of sea salt, a fourth teaspoon of freshly ground black pepper, and two tablespoons of canola oil. Tommy, what type of Italian seasoning are you using? Well, I'm very glad you asked, mysterious voice. In today's recipe, our Italian seasoning of choice is gonna be oregano. Thank you. You're welcome. To start off the recipe, let's start with the egg. To prepare the egg, we're going to take a bowl and we're going to crack the egg into the bowl. Then, with your whisk of choice, you'll whisk it for two to three minutes. After having separated all the ingredients into separate dishes, Proceed to pour all of the ingredients into one large mixing bowl. Then, after having washed your hands properly, use your hands to mix all the ingredients together. After mixing the ingredients in a large mixing bowl for about four to five minutes, Take the meat mixture and form as many roughly two inch balls as you can. Then after forming those two inch balls, set them aside for our next step. Now in order to cook our meatballs, we're going to have to prepare our cooking setup. For this, we're going to take the two tablespoons of canola oil and put them in a large skillet. Then with the skillet and oil, we're going to put it over a medium to high heat. When the oil begins to bubble, that's when you'll know that the meatballs are ready to be cooked. Place the meatballs one at a time on the hot skillet. Then, for 15 minutes, turn the meatballs over and over until all the sides of them are lightly brown. After making sure that all your meatballs are thoroughly cooked through, one at a time you can begin to take all of them off the skillet and onto a separate plate. After all the meatballs have been taken off the skillet, turn off the heat and wait for your meatballs to cool for about one minute. And once you're done with that, your meatballs are ready to be eaten. Let's take a test, shall we? Now that is one tasty meatball. Tune in next time when I teach you how to make delicious dishes at home. Goodbye for now, and remember, keep it cooking, good looking.